My name is Ronald Olivier. In 1999, when I enrolled in the Bible College, I believe that's the moment where God really taught me how to love. The seminary program changed the culture of Angola. I know that for a fact because I've seen it and I've lived it. And we had an independent researcher from Baylor to come and evaluate our model for more rehabilitation, and he confirmed what we already knew to be true, that the seminary really did change the prison. So my goal now is to get a seminary program in every state in the whole country. We want to equip the inmates to minister to their peers. And that's the key to it, minister to their peers. As their hearts are healed through more rehabilitation, we, we will have safer prisons and we'll have what's most important, fewer victims of violent crime. Recidivism rates will go down, It'll be good. When they graduate from the seminary, the peer ministers are gonna be in the population 24 seven. There's no volunteer, no chaplain, no one else from the outside is gonna be able to be with them 24 hours a day. The inmate ministers can serve the prison in many ways, operating as pastors that shepherd their own flock. They can lead Bible studies and encourage the men, and they relate to the inmates in a way that nobody else can because they live their walk. And go to seek ye first! Seek ye first! The kingdom of God and His righteousness! When inmates exhibit authentic peace and joy, even when facing long incarceration, such as a life sentence, for example, their peers notice. Listen, for sure, a moral inmate is the most valuable asset that any prison can have. A man or woman who is incarcerated yet no longer is a life taker, but is a life giver, is really a big advantage to the prison and keeps it safer. There were, there were many people that God used me to touch their lives, man. Just watching God just change people's lives right before your eyes, man, it's awesome. Because of their seminary training, these women have come to a place of healing in their own self, and now they can minister to those around them, their peers. I am so okay, and I have seen that I have affected more people positively here than I ever did before I came here. In fact, I probably helped to destroy some lives. Burl Kane has helped launch 13 seminary programs in 12 states already. We invest in these men and women and then release them to speak into the wounds of others within the prison system. To learn more about the Global Prison Seminaries Foundation, please visit our website. We'd love to hear from you. And please ask for our Foundation's summary report based on our moral rehabilitation research.